It's Holland Nguyen here for OG Fitness, a smart, sustainable, and functional approach to martial arts for older guys like myself. So in this video, uh, I want to talk about UFC 229 press conference that just happened uh, not, uh, not too long ago uh, today. And wow, yeah. So there was no fans, so that was kind of weird. Like you didn't hear a lot of sound at all. It was just um, Connor and Khabib on stage, uh, Dana White, and then he had all the reporters and shit. So Connor comes in, you know, all, uh, all, all comes in really strong. He's dressed up nice, you know, he's flashy. Comes in with his uh, 12, uh, what's it called again? <laughs> Uh, something, something proper 12 whiskey, which uh, I like the name, honestly. So he's promoting it the whole time. He's talking a lot of shit, going after Khabib. Khabib, well, you know, English isn't his first language. So I think that in this press conference, he was, um, a lot of times he didn't really understand like what the heck uh, Connor was talking about, you know? And you gotta remember, Connor also talks with a, a Irish accent in English. And Khabib, well, English is in his first language, so you talk fast, plus you talk with your Irish accent. Like, he's gonna, he's gonna miss a lot of, uh, of what you're talking about. And um, so, most of, so most of the press conference was just Connor like, talking shit to Khabib. And then Khabib was just there, he was like, yeah, whatever, he didn't really give a shit. And um, when he would try to answer back, well, obviously, you know, uh, Connor would just like uh, talk, o talk over him. And a couple of times that Khabib did, did talk and that we did manage to hear what he said, it was, um, it was good, man. Because at one point, he told, um, uh, you know, Connor was saying to Khabib, oh, you know, you're a pussy, blah, 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 blah. You know, like you, you were there with your, 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 your crew and then you slapped, um, what's his face, uh, Artem, Artem Lobov, right? Uh, Connor's buddy. And uh, blah, 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 it's not the right thing to do. So now, you know, we're going to settle this, you know, on and on and on. And then Khabib told him, well, no, because if I would have slapped him and, well, what, he didn't defend himself, you know? So what kind of guys do you hang out with? A bunch of pussies, you know? <laughs> so Connor didn't really have an answer to that. And that, that was fucking hilarious. And it is true because uh, if it was real slap and then, you know, in, in, well, in Khabib's uh, mind, right, the way he's, he's saying it is that, well, if I slapped your buddy and your buddy didn't slap me back, then your buddy's a pussy. So you're hanging around with a bunch of pussies. That's what he's telling Connor. Anyways, blah, 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 blah. Long story short, um, I don't think Khabib was, um, uh, how do you say it? He, Connor didn't get into Khabib's head, in my opinion. Um, he probably just kind of got him a little bit frustrated. Like, Khabib probably is going to, you know, uh, prolong the beating and probably talk shit while he's beating up on Connor. And that brings me to my prediction for this fight. I'm gonna go with Khabib. I, I like both of them. I think Connor is a great fighter. He has the death touch, you know, he can knock you out with that left hand, uh, distance management, confidence, blah, blah, blah. He's, he's really cool. Um, now, the thing is, Khabib is 26-0, and 0, and I know that some people will say that, okay, it's, it's inflated, he, 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 he beat like uh, a bunch of nobodies, but think about it though, because I come from a, a big, um, well, a big, a grappling background, right? I have about six years of uh, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, uh, and now I have close to three years of, uh, of Judo, so that's about <clears throat> almost 10 years of, of grappling. And man, I, I gotta tell you, like, I, I've I've grappled with some guys who 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 are Olympians, okay, in judo, and mm, you don't realize how strong these guys are, man. These guys are like super athletes, super duper athletes, super strong, super technical. And now Khabib didn't—he's not an Olympic athlete. But I mean, he's been wrestling since he's like fucking two years old in the mountains in Dagestan. And, and we all know that Eastern Europeans, right, they're very, very high level when it comes to wrestling. And this guy's been doing it forever. And here's the thing. He knows how to strike because he does sambo, right? So there's a lot of striking. His striking, he probably has a couple of holds here and there that we saw, you know, like he, he kind of leaves his chin a little bit up. He does get tagged and stuff like that. But I mean... 
he's he's not a stranger to striking and also I find that with his level of grappling you can't prepare for for his level of grappling in in a year or even two it's impossible this guy has a lifetime of grappling so there's no way that Connor in my opinion would be able to prepare for that now on the other side though Khabib he's been striking for a long time too it might not be uh, at the level of Connor but I'm sure it's not gonna take him as much time to you know let's say it would take Connor 10 years or 20 years to get to that level right of, of where Khabib's at well with Khabib it's not gonna take him that much time to 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 fill in the holes of his stand-up game just so that he won't get knocked the fuck out by Connor you see what I mean here Whereas Connor, it would take him fucking 10, 20 years to, to, uh, to get to, to even a level where he could actually contest like a guy like a Khabib in, in, in wrestling, okay? Khabib, well, he doesn't have to become as good as Connor. He just has to plug his holes, you know? And, and that'll be enough for him to get the takedown. Whereas um, like Connor, let's forget about him trying to get to the level of Khabib. Let's, let's just talk about him trying to plug the holes so in his in his case it would be defending the takedown or getting back up from the takedown I don't think you could do that man not even in two years man you know even if you get the best coaches and shit because it's 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 really my opinion that no it, there's just too much of a too much of a gap in terms of skill level uh, when it comes to grappling and wrestling so Connor won't be able to close that gap you know in in the last two years or, or that he hasn't fought and um, but I think that um, Khabib w is able to game plan and 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 adjust a few things in his boxing so that he doesn't get knocked out and then from there well it's gonna be a long night man Khabib's gonna drag his ass down to the floor and he's gonna beat him up for you know for 25 minutes because well Khabib has an amazing gas tank he's been wrestling forever so he's not gonna gas now don't get me wrong that's my prediction uh, if I had to put money I would put it on Khabib but but regardless I'm happy whoever wins because it's gonna be a show because if Connor wins it's probably gonna be the first or second round uh, he's gonna knock him the fuck out you know or TKO his ass whatever you know and uh, so it's gonna be a good fight <laughs> and Connor's amazing so you know uh, I'd be happy if he wins and um, I'd be happy if Khabib kicks his ass because you know that's who I'm I like Khabib too and since I'm a grappler so either way I'm happy I can't wait for this shit to go down so like comment and subscribe and uh, hit the notification bell for my next video and really, like, let me know what you think. Who do you think is going to win? And if you have, like, uh, arguments against what I just said, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's, 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 uh, let's put it on the table and talk about it. All right, guys, peace. Have a good night.